Let's start with the most important part of the song, the chorus. It needs to be catchy and repetitive, with lots of things going on. To start a new song, tap on the plus icon in the top left corner of the screen. Tap Create New Song. Slide your finger across the screen to see the instruments available to use in your song. The first instrument we're going to use is the Smart Guitar. This has a cog around it which lets us know that it has some features which can help us create some amazing sounding guitar riffs. Tap once on the Smart Guitar. Here we see an acoustic guitar and the letters denote eight different chords that we can play. Start on the left hand side and tap the EM. You will hear the chord of E minor being strummed. Now moving to the right, tap the AM chord, then the DM, the G, the C, the F, the B flat and the B diminished. This is a smart guitar because it can change the way it plays the chords. In the top right hand area of the screen you will see a knob called autoplay. Tap the number one and then tap any chord name. You will hear the chord being played as a real guitarist might play it. Tap autoplay number two, then three, then four. Here are four different ways to play a single chord. Before you decide which you like best, remember your song planning sheet. Maybe a gentle acoustic guitar is not quite what you're after. Perhaps you want something a little rockier. To change this, we can choose to play on another guitar. Tap the picture of the acoustic guitar. You now see three other guitars. Classic Clean, Hard Rock and Roots Rock. It is important to spend time finding exactly the right guitar sound that you want and then the right autoplay riff. For example, if I tap the Classic Clean guitar, tap a chord, change the autoplay number, I will hear another four guitar riffs. Try all the guitars and all the autoplay numbers until you have found exactly what you're looking for to create your catchy chorus. Pause the video whilst you choose. 